Well, hello. I hope everyone had, had uh, let me say this again. I hope everyone had a wonderful Christmas. Ours was very relaxing. It was bittersweet. I'm not going to get into it, but we did lose um, a close family member this December. So it was kind of bittersweet, like I'd say. But um, anywho, other than that, um, which I'm calling, that's the reason why I haven't really been crafting or doing Christmas crafts until now. And I haven't been in the Christmas spirit, but I'm still going to do some Christmas crafts in um, or throughout January. So I wanted to share this I made yesterday. This was a pocket letter that I'm going to send out to a friend, and I hope she likes it. Um, sorry for the glare. I have to figure out how to do lighting. My lighting in this house stinks. It's really bad. So, and then not to mention I don't have space to do a nice, um, you know, video or pictures. So this is my bootleg little station here for that. So please bear with me with that. But anywho, I did this. The paper line I use, I have the 12 by 12 set, which is what I use, but I'm just going to show you the 8 by 8 paper pad just so you can get an idea is this set. It's called 12 Days of Christmas and I got this from the paper studio at Hobby Lobby. Um, I got this a while back. So I have the 8x8, I have the 12x12 and I do have as well, which is what I use for some of the embellishments, the paper crafting kit. So it comes with the 12x12 sheets, it comes with stickers and embellishments. So yeah, and all that. So I use that as well. So let's get started. I'm going to put it in this tin. I got this tin for Christmas. Um, it was with gift cards. Um, so I thought this was so cute and it matched perfectly with it. So I added, I'm going to add some goodies in there as well. But I'm going to fit the pocket letter in here. It fits perfectly. After I tie it up, it'll stay put. And I'm going to add some other embellishments as well. Let's see if I can move this. Okay, so that is the pocket letter. This is the bottom, which is actually going to be like the main focal in the in the tin and so that was part of the embellishments I love this it's like a little um, one of those old-fashioned red cars and um, it has a tree on the top I use stickers from Dollar Tree it says be happy and smile this is some washi tape I had in my stash probably I want to say I got it or received it I think it was from Michaels it could be from Target or Michaels I'm not mistaken but it was either last year or the year before so I did that this paper was from the 8x8 um, paper pad. because Some of them are a little bit different. So I did that. I added some goodies. I don't want to show them just yet. So and this paper is a little bit thinner. So I um, I doubled it. That on um, The 12x12 paper pad is um, much thicker than the 8x8 pad. And then I did create a shaker. And then on this side, I had some gold glittered paper. 12x12 from Joann's. I don't want to take it out either, but anyways, I'm going to give you an idea. I did, and then I used some of the paper from the paper line, and then this was a sticker from the, the paper kit, and it says five golden rings that had like the 12 days of Christmas, and some flat back gems um, from Saw Crafters, and then this paper, I had these tags, I'll pull this out, and I'll pull out the other piece with it, oh, dang it, you've seen that part, anyways, this was a little um like christmas tags i received oh not received i purchased after was it after christmas no before christmas right before christmas from five below they had those that look like little booklets so i thought that was really cute like a little miniature card so i added that to that and then the top part i didn't do another shaker piece and i put a sticker on top then i added a little it's really cute um oh, this camera um, a little paper clip that I purchased a while back. This was from um, Webster Pages when they used to have like boxes. And then this is a sheet. Let's take this out. This one I created. I had some of the what is it called? Um, doilies that I received. I think I purchased them last year um, from Michaels after um, Valentine's Day. It was like a kit. Of different color ones and so I decided to place it on top of the, it's the same paper as this one the plaid but I thought I'd do something a little bit different this was another cutout piece from the collection and then I added a sticker that says Merry Christmas and then so fun yippee these are from Dollar Tree and then I added some gold sequins to kind of bring out the gold in the whole line 
And then lastly, I did this pocket. And this one was, I consider it simple. I had these embellishments, these wood um, embellishments from a while back. I don't even remember where I purchased those, to be quite honest with you. But I had these for a long time. So I decided to pull them out and use the Noel. Um, this sticker was from this year from Michaels, like the little foam stickers in the kids section. And I used part of another doily and some trim from, I believe it was from Michaels as well. If not Michaels, then um, Joann's. So that's my pocket letter. I'm sorry for the crappy video. I'm still learning. Anyways, if you can, for you ladies that do awesome videos and lighting, can you please um, put in the description or like down below, write a comment, um, what camera do you guys use? Um, and then what um, editing do you use as well? I'm gonna try to edit this video. If not, I might just leave it like this. But yeah, what editing do you use as well? But um, anyways, I hope she likes it. I hope you guys liked it. And thank you for your patience with this crappy video. But um, yeah, thanks again. And thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.